Hello and welcome to the show. We're back on GTA 5 for a, another re Reese-made stunt map. Thank you for that one. We will go. Get that didn't really have the same effect as I'd hoped it would have. Uh, <laughs> it's a good day. Everyone's managed to be put. Oh, that's that's not such a good day for 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 us. Well, we managed to break our cars before we've started. Um, yes, we're going to race it with the uh, Rapid GT Classic around a rather mean and interesting stunt race. Me and Reese have already managed to crash into each other uh, straight away. We will get off the grid with a fair amount of wheel spin. And hopefully try not to have a very big accident early on. It's not the craziest circuit we've ever done, but there are some really interesting uh, sections that we are going to have to uh, deal with. If we can try to keep it clean through this opening bit, the Rapid GTs are quite easy to get very oversteery and get out of uh, shape. Oh, Reese is going to get turned in front of the pack. I'm going to manage to avoid all of that. We'll still be stuck on the outside, but that's okay for now. Uh, I'm not going to go too fast into there because I don't want to clump the building. Oh, I nearly got aerial attacked by Reese. Uh, we are up into a fifth place. Try and run the wall. I would have run the wall. It would have been fine if it wasn't for the fact the car ahead of me <laughs> hit the wall and got stuck. Bugger. Oh, someone very... I thought they were going to explode from that one. They got away with that. Oh, Blinkmobiles mulled me into a wall. I don't like Blinkmobiles. Oh, too wide into the narrow bit. Oh, we were, it was all going so well and then it wasn't going so well. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> bugger, bugger and blast. We were doing, we were right at the front, and now we were really not right at the front. Oh, somebody's tumbled off the uh, lure level. Blink the bills going all around the place. So this section is kind of a, a multiple route loop that, uh, well, you end up heading into oncoming traffic. Checkpoints are bounced around as people are trying to fight their way. I've, I've made up a lot of positions in that section. We're up into 8th place now through all of that. And then it goes, I think that, that looks like the lead of the race there. Then we go into the roundabout section. This is new. We haven't had one of these. Well, we've driven around roundabouts in races but we've never had a full full roundabout section before, you know, because we just need to go round in circles uh, here. Oh, dodge the Reese. Uh, somehow we've made our way <laughs> into sixth place as the leaders are now trying to leave the roundabout. Oh, you've plummeted off that. Well done. Bye-bye. <laughs> We're up into six. I think that yellow car, we basically made an entire lap around or entire loop around that roundabout in the time it took that yellow car to recover from his, uh, from his spin. Then we've got to be really careful because then we've got the stairway here and the stairway is quite... Oh, Oh, quite difficult. There's a reason why I slowed down. Thankfully, I was going slow enough that uh, we could recover all of that one. Oh, <laughs> guess who's blowing up first again? <laughs> Every time. Every time. We're going to leave the first lap in fourth place. Well, it was a frantic and quite, uh, quite busy opening lap in which... Uh, a lot of things went wrong for me, and then we somehow ended up in a fourth place. The top three look like they're actually running very, very close together. I'm hoping with a little bit of catch-up and a little bit of teamwork. I mean, I'm not going to race the car behind me too hard. If he wants to get past, that's fine, because we'll just slipstream train our way up towards the lead group. I am perfectly okay with that one. Hit the boost here. Now, you want to be getting the car turning already. That's good. That's good. That's good. Oh, it's perfect for the both of us. Oh, I might have just given pink, pink a punt. A uh, little bit of a laggy punt. Oh, then the <laughs> favour was returned. Ah, quick. Go, 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 go. There was so much. Speed. Both me and the yellow car carried at incredible speed off of that, uh, that loop. If you get it right, it's fantastic. But when you do get it right, oh, that was close. Yeah, when you do get it right, that often means that you are carrying a lot of speed in an awkward place and the car gets very, very oversteery. Uh, we are in fourth, but now we are going to be heading into the oncoming zone. Okay, now we're clear of the oncoming zone. That puts us up into third. Uh, the leader is going to be running around the, uh, well, the roundabout on his own. He's a whole, a whole circuit around here ahead of us. Oh, God, Pink's trying to get to the inside. Now, you don't want to oh, really leave the gap on the inside too much if you can help it as well, we're about to get past there now. However, oh, <laughs> someone missed a checkpoint, I think. Maybe they were hugging the inside too much. We've lost a position, but we gained one in Yellow's uh, mistake there. So we're going to move up to third. We'll take second, but we'll probably end up slipstream training our way 
for a little while, but we've got to judge this uh, right. Oh, slow it down. Okay, I found the limit. Let's not do any quicker than that, because I might not have any control if I do it any quicker than that. Uh, right, jump down here. Make sure we grab this checkpoint over that way. We've got to... <laughs> this is a really arsey place checkpoint because if you go sort of flat out straight line towards it you'll actually just fire yourself off into the scenery so you've got to be really really mindful of uh, that particular particular section okay second place so progress lap after lap has been has been progress considering we're fourth and a fair way down the lead trio we are now second uh, when i get out of these i'm not going to get out of the corners quick there we go uh, five and a half seconds to go to the little oh, well that five and a half seconds has gone down a lot quicker than expected <laughs> we are right there with the leader now run up the bank that's good i think we are actually going to come out of this in first <laughs> oh well it was close. It was close. I've kind of got the knack. I really like that. Ch I love that corner. I'm really enjoying that corner. Oh, the red car thought better of it. I'm very, very glad of that because we would have had a big spin. <laughs> we are into the crossover point. Oh, dodge the red car. I think maybe the red and grey had had an accident. Uh, nope. The grey car might have had an accident. It's own. <laughs> This is getting really close and really dangerous at all of the crossover points there. That's... <laughs> How the hell are we still going? I don't know. That's incredible. I will take it. Because that was... For, for spectacle's sake, that is phenomenal. But uh, I'm not sure for heart rate's sake that that is going quite so well. All right. Continue to loop around. That check was a little bit further out wide. You've got to be aware. Uh, oh! Reese is appearing! Oh, God. Purple car has, I think, got spun either by the red car. Landed on the red car. I don't know. We've got a little bit of a gap. We've got a little bit... <laughs> it's mayhem. It's complete and utter mayhem. However... Once again, the progress... Oh, Christ. Brakes, 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 brakes. There we go. I was going a lot slower because of the catch-up, and I slightly forgot how um, much I needed to slow down. Eh, it's okay. I mean, with this thing, we go to supercars next. They're going to be a lot faster than this, so... That'll probably be scarier on that particular section. With this, you get a little bit more leeway. Well, I mean, I would say that this track is suiting me pretty well. <laughs> after an abysmal start, after everything going wrong at the start of the race, we have methodically, methodically made our way up through the order. Now, if the race was about to finish here, I'd be, I'd be okay with that. You know, this was the final lap. As I say, that was the final lap. If this was the final lap, I'd probably find a way to get screwed over with about two corners to go. However. Let's try and not do anything silly for the uh, remainder of this one. Run the bank. Wow, you're going a lot slower when you are leading the race by miles and catch-up is in full effect. God, <laughs> it's really so noticeable on that boost pad how little speed that we have gained. Of course, I can have as big a lead as I like, but we are going to once more come up against... Oh, well, that... <laughs> Oncoming cars. I wasn't expecting them to be there. Oh, well, at least <laughs> he's managed to crash first and second off. At least it was even. You know, at least at least it was fair. Screwed over <laughs> both of us equally. Uh, oh, tried to stay out of the way. I wasn't sure if they're going to be tight on the inside or out wide through there. We're still going to have uh, the top four. are going to have a fair margin over the rest of the field. But anything can happen in the roundabout section because we'll be kind of everywhere... <laughs> It's just a congregation point for cars. Not the sort of vehicles I lap down, but just at different points in their lap is a congregation point. Oh, am I going to be a full... I think I am going to be a full tour around here ahead of the grey car that'll be in second. Oh, but then it does mean I'm giving him slipstream, although in giving him slipstream, he might end up with some uh, some oversteer, which I can potentially... I say potentially use. He could potentially do without. Right. Oh, no, it wasn't the grey car that was in second. We've now got a blue car chasing us down, and all of the catch-up is being in effect, because I'm doing about 20 miles an hour. Hello, guys. How's it going? Because uh, we're going to go and try and jump our way down here. Oh, that's a really sneaky way of doing things, and that's going to be a really easy way to screw up. Oh, red car almost got us. Uh, if I was clever, I could potentially use the handbrake and uh, try and like twist the car in the air. I'm not going quite maximum attack over that final jump there, because I'm trying to make sure I do get the checkpoint. Um, right, so there are yeah, there are two of them. Two of them are on the lead lap. I think there was a brown car that ended up getting uh, reset up there, but I'm not quite sure what was going on. Oh, bloody hell, there's a three-car battle for positions ahead. <laughs> lap down. I think this is about the most cars we've lapped in a race. 
I'll be honest. I think it might be the most cars that uh, that we've seen lapped in a race. Oh, there's an abandoned one. <laughs> Why is there an abandoned car? Oh, bugger. Okay, that, there's no contact in all of that. We're going to get the boost. Try desperately not to smack into his car. Got a big oversteer moment. That's not going to help me. But we didn't lose it completely. We didn't go round. So that's fine. Uh, oh, we're going to fly through there with a lot more speed than we have been seeing before. Again, we've caught it now. Do we follow the red car? Um, yeah, I think we do. And I'm going to join him. Is it actually a good plan here? Whoa! No, oh, damn it. It was a good plan in going around here. How what was exploded? Um, the, the, the theory being, if I follow, you know, we follow the car that was going to be a lap down and it might keep us out of trouble better. Oh, Lagmobile got me. It's all getting a little bit chaotic between lap down cars, cars we're racing for. I don't even know who we're racing where for position and whatnot, but uh, I think red car on the on the roundabout is... Uh, oh, blue, <laughs> blue, blue blink mobile landed on the back of somebody who got carted off the course. Uh, there's already been an orange betrayal. Uh, oh, pink is, I think, is there legitimately now. Oh, I'm not really sure. Uh, it's a little bit scary. Green might be on our lap. Oi! <laughs> the orange traitor has got off the course. Uh, <laughs> I don't even know. What car did we get? I mean, kind of got a little bit landed on, but it's sort of a weird way to spin off the track. Oh, well. Uh, we've got... Oh, Blinkmobile's overtaken us. Oh, Blinkmobile, I'm going to punt into space and then try to avoid punting. Oh, I somehow held that on the road. I apologise, Blinkmobile, but not really very much I could do. Ah! <laughs> well, I guess we've... Uh... We're, 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 we've traded the other orange team car as well. This is a bit of a crazy fest, quite frankly. I don't even know who which one of these cars is on our on the same lap as us uh, there is a fair bit of gap back basically uh, now after I think Blinkmobile was on I'm fairly sure Blinkmobile was on our lap and they got served off the course uh, yeah there's I think the car behind maybe the car actually behind us on the map is not the car in second I think that might be a lap down vehicle uh, we are catching the leader. We might catch them either at a good point or at all of, all of the wrong point, basically. If we catch them at just the right time, it will be the final sector and we will be able to make the most of a slipstream run towards the finish line. If we catch them too soon, we will slipstream our way past them before the line and they can then slipstream back on us. We might actually get a long way, we might catch up to them uh, a long way before we get to at that point point i'm happy to go this way i'm happy to stick with them i mean there's we're only going to hinder ourselves if we crash into each other there's going to be no no advantage gained to either of us so staying out of trouble no that's not what i wanted that's not what i wanted at all I, now i am going to be oh all sorts of wonky thanks for that laggy bloody cars uh <laughs> Nah, not going to do it now. Unless he gets taken out by, uh, well, by me joining in here, uh, which you know, I'm not, I'm not, I, I could deliberately torpedo him, but I'm not going to. And yeah, he's, <laughs> he's wise. He knows I'm a circuit down on him around here. There is no point fighting that. And I've got the increased power unless he has trouble, which I don't think he is going to with the other traffic around here. Oh, I'm going to have big trouble of my own. I don't think I can catch him. Unless he makes a mistake. Unless he makes a big, big mistake. Oh, it was going so well for that final showdown. And in the end, yeah, we got uh, we got taken taken out. Oh, break, 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 break. And we cannot, uh, cannot do anything. I threw all of the speed I had at that final stuff. Uh, we just pulled it up in time. But we are not going to be able to take a victory. It was looking promising for a very long time. At the end of the day, still a pretty good result. However... Going to have to be second place. Ah, that is a very, very crazy race. That is a very crazy race indeed. Don't know if there are going to be any other good... I, I'm sure there will probably be some good battles somewhere on the... Uh, on the track over some sort of positions. It'll probably be a little bit of a wait uh, around here. I think there'll be a fair few mistakes from the various cars that have dropped them so far back. With, like, slipstream and catch-up on, you don't expect the cars to be quite so far back. Someone's managed to lose a tyre in all of that mayhem. Uh, seven of us have managed to uh, make it to the finish line. Fastest lap, kind of a little bit irrelevant in many ways with, of course, catch-up. 
having a big effect. Oh, a yellow Rapid GT got up to third. We, I don't think we saw one, not for a uh, long amount of time. Yeah, the car we're riding on is very, very poorly. Okay, race number one, and a second place, second place for me. Uh, let's have, ah, oh, there's, there, that's why, there have been some shenanigans. There has been some shen <laughs> shenanigans, perhaps. Uh, there'll certainly be some shenanigans uh, when the countdown started. Either way, a good start. Hopefully, we can go one better. So, for our second race, we have got something considerably faster. This, the Visioni, I don't know, generic hypercar, essentially. Not a bad-looking vehicle, but... Uh, yeah, had a generic GTA 5 hypercar, and uh, hopefully, hopefully we can do as well, if not better, than uh, than last race. Well, I'm going to get stuck on the outside here, aren't I? And it's going to be a big old, oh, I was trying to stay out of the big old mess, and it didn't quite work. <laughs> it's always going to be, all it takes is just the tiniest nudge. It takes one car to make a mistake or carry a bit, whoa, how on earth did they end up doing that? I don't know. I mean, lag probably won't have helped. I was going to say, all it takes is one car doing something a little bit wrong, and uh, <laughs> there's a big old mess. In this case, apparently, uh, a lot of cars have done a lot bit wrongs, and then there's still, well, there's, there's been a big old mess for uh, everybody involved. Right, let's go up around the loop and down the other side, lovely and smooth. Well, we'll give Pink a little bit of assistance. <laughs> I really like that loop. I, I really like that loop. That's really good fun. Especially when you get things right. Oh, oh I'm going to get on the brake. That's a good overtake from the pink car if he can hold it there. He is uh, going to just about keep it on the inside. Uh, whoa, and then we're into traffic again. Clear. <laughs> just, just go. Go. Fight your way through the mayhem. We are through. Reese has bumped into the pink car. We're into the roundabout. Oh, God. I've just seen the horde of vehicles behind. Run away. Run away. It's also always scary when you see Reese's car appear in the uh, <laughs> third person camera view. Just continue to run around here. I think the leader might have managed to make it through all of that chaos because the cars joining in were joining in just as the leader was getting to that point so I think he might have made it through all of that cleanly oh god that's not the sight you want to see behind you uh, that's oh a green car's got a big jump there oh god I'm gonna go on the brakes here nice and early oh everybody's tumbling hello no 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 no, no. I can't really do anything here <laughs> don't explode please don't explode <laughs> That was uh, not the not the cleanest or quickest or best way to deal with the stairs. However, none of us actually got fired off the course, so I guess that is a bonus. Uh, oh, one's exploded, one's reset. I guess they missed the checkpoint. And, uh, well, there we go. I mean, kind of keep in keeping with the first race, we had a mess on the opening lap. We were a little bit higher up for a lot more of that lap, but we worked our way to sixth. So if we can, again, methodically work our way forward in all of this, then I am okay. We have got some company, though, with us. Uh, we've got two cars. Oh, I can't quite carry that much speed there, and that was screwed up by me. My bad. <laughs> Thought I could get away with a lot more speed through there than I actually could. Not the cleverest idea I've ever had, but we're going up towards my favourite part of the course, so loop around we go, and then straight down here. Oh, again with the cars. I get it lovely, and then there's somebody in the bloody way every time. <laughs> I had so much momentum coming off of that, and now it is all gone. It is all sad, and uh, yeah, not there anymore. Try and dodge the cars that are heading out of this area. I'm not even sure if I want to try and hug the inside or hug the outside around here to try and stay out of trouble. Oh, just sort of see cars and hopefully manage to dodge them. Oh, there's a Reese through a gap. We found it. It'd be more fun if these vehicles launched each other. Uh, that would be quite entertaining if they launched each other when, with the head-on collisions. Uh, unfortunately, not the case. Just, everybody stopped dead. Wow, the leader has got a huge gap leaving the roundabout already. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Oh, oh. thought I could sneak by. I kind of hoped I would end up ahead and be able to sneak by that grey car, but that was not the case. Uh, there's going to be a car jumping onto the roundabout, but they're going to be behind me, so that's fine. Don't care too much about that. We will leave here. There's a big squabble going on behind. Um, thankfully, they are a little bit further back. Looks like the groups up ahead. I mean, the groups are still there, but they are a little bit more spread out than they were previous, so that's okay. Uh, 
turn around here. Not really made, I say not really made a huge amount of progress. We can kind of see, oh, I say we can see we're a lot closer to those cars. Kind of a little bit deceptive, the stairs down here, because you kind of all bunch up as you go down them, and then it spreads out once you start getting the acceleration zone. Sort of like the Constantina effect that goes on at hairpins, only to a greater extent because, well, we're jumping down stairs. You know, the, the normal the normal things for a <laughs> fail race GTA 5 racing stuff. Uh, we have got uh, cars kind of closer behind us than we are to getting to the vehicles ahead. Don't do the same dumb thing again. I keep thinking I can take that flat out and you can't. Right, now there may not be a vehicle directly ahead of me this time. We may be able to go and get this glorious, glorious loop around. And there we go, look at that. <laughs> when that when that works, that might be one of my favourite corners. When when that works, that may well be one of the favourite corners that I have uh, come across or in any game circuit, quite frankly. Um, as far as our progress up the field goes, we've made a position last lap, but only a uh, solitary position. Uh, we're about to go into the big old mess. Sorry, grey car. Although, although... We, we made a nuisance of ourselves slightly, but not as much of a nuisance as it was made for the cars ahead of us. So, there is potential here. Yellow is still leading by an absolute mile, because he's... I think, was he two circuits ahead of me last time? Two two trips around the merry roundabouts? Uh, I think he, he might have been. Either way, we're not going to be catching him anytime soon without a big mess. And we're not lapping cars the same speed that we are as we were with the... I guess we've still got a few laps to go, <laughs> as we did with the Rapid GT. Or maybe Yellow fell off, because we've had to change a lead, or something weird might have gone on at the front of the race there. All right, let's get this slowed down. Oh, yeah. Judging by the tyre marks there, something, uh, something, a big whoopsie went on for the cars at the front. So it might be, yeah, it might not be impossible. Again, solid progress, if not spectacular, at the uh, at this stage of the race. Yeah, 15 seconds to the lead. It is a sizable, sizable gap, but... It was definitely, definitely something has affected them. The frame rate is having its own, well, unsurprising issues. We've got silly sky tracks and we're racing in very, very fast supercars. And yeah, the, fa <laughs> the frame rate does its own thing regularly. Uh, it looks like there might have been a kerfuffle possibly going on in the tunnel. Really hard to try and use the mini-map to figure out what the hell is happening. And up around the loop we go. Oh, they felt a little bit late to come down from that. It's just a, kind of a little bit fine, but we are down now. Uh, oh, I think there might have been a uh, head-on in the crossover point down here as well. Look like, again, judging from the uh, the dots. Oh, I spy a green car. I spy a green car that I want to get a position off of. Oh, sorry, green car. I'll wait for green car because that was my bad. Uh, <laughs> that was my bad in that one. I try. I saw a gap. We went for said gap. Almost worked, just not quite. Right, so we've, we've made up like... <laughs> we're measuring this in rotations around the roundabout because we've essentially made up a rotation on the two leaders over the course of that last lap because they're now shooting off down there. So yeah, we've, we've made progress and I've now got a slipstream uh, buddy for a little while at least. Oh, got a big, big wiggle there that I didn't want. Third is not so far away from that lead pair. We're going to have mega slipstream. Oh, aerial attack! Oh, <laughs> was a good aerial attack. That one there was a very, very good aerial attack. Oh, oh my God, we both were so lucky. I know. <laughs> How many millimeters was there in that between me and going off the edge? And the green car only got away with it because he managed to bounce his way down onto the lower platform. We carried a bit too much speed there. I I'm gonna, I'm gonna say we, we carried a little bit too much speed in all of that. <laughs> Let's not do that one again. We've got a couple of laps that will have all of that lovely gains that we had made has all completely gone out the window now because we're both very nearly, very, very nearly fell off the platform. That's a better line through there. Right, green car, if you screw up leaving the tunnel here and I don't get to do my favourite line around there, I'm going to be really disappointed. Uh, right, oh, we got way, 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 way too much angle almost it was a weird one yep yeah, didn't go didn't go to plan green car's not going to screw us over oh they might screw us over through the next corner bloody hell uh, we're fine we're fine oh there's a red car we're going to dive into this section yellow can go past i think we're now good so the methodical work our way up positions per lap not quite planned out and green car has lagged its way through me that's fun uh 
I guess that's how you make advantages from those collisions, is uh, if you lag your way through the opposing car and they stop dead, then you, you gain. That is very true. We're going to jump our way onto the roundabout. I mean, we are actually still... Oh, that's the leaders. I've got to go around, guys. I, I really wouldn't try getting to the inside of me, because when you want to leave the roundabout, you're going to have a tougher time. Yeah, go to the outside of my car. Uh, that's where you want to be. You don't want to be on the inside of me around here. Nobody's going to be affecting us in the jump onto the platform. Uh, in fact, is that there? Okay, so the green car's behind us. I think there's a grey vehicle in fifth place, possibly. Not sure. Either way, we are going to be heading out of the tunnel. Now, let's not do what we did last time, please. Oh, Yellow has made a mistake. Yellow has fallen off the platform. Is there another podium in the offering I sense here? Oh, Green's very, very near, and he plummeted off. I think Green has made a big old error in that. I think he tried to take a too tight a return in all of that and missed a checkpoint. Yeah, Green's, Green's gone. Right, the final lap. Can we get a podium in all of the mayhem of the roundabout race? I don't know, maybe I'll come up with a better name for it. You'll probably know, because it'll probably be the title of the video. Uh, <laughs> can we hunt down that uh, podium? I wanted a, a win, but a second and a third is still not too bad going. First and a second would be better if by uh, any chance the leaders get into trouble. It's unlikely, I mean, I can have as much speed as I like here, but it's unlikely I'm going to be able to uh, catch them. Right, that's uh, not gone well. Ah, oh, cock. I, I saw when I was going up around the loop that that wasn't going well. Well, we're not going to be getting a podium, guys. Uh, oh, I'm not even going to get a boost there. That's going to be really difficult to make our way up here. Uh, <laughs> I could see that one going wrong as well. That's, that's the worst thing. When you've, I, I, when you've been doing that corner really well up until that point, and then you just see you've made that small error on the way in, and you know that that's going to have a bad time. Oh, that's... Oh, well, it's all gone wrong now. Uh, so I've suddenly got a lot more speed because I'm a lot further back in the pack than I have had in previous uh, <laughs> previous laps as well. So that's uh, yeah, not helping me through there. Uh, well, I guess maybe the best we could really get now is a fifth, I think. Sixth, possibly. A uh, green car's going to be... A head a lap around here. Bucker it. Yeah, I screwed it all up. I'm sorry. <laughs> Damn. Typical. It would have been fine if it had been the first lap. We would have had time to recover, but no. It's the final lap, and it was always going to happen, because it is it is the fail race way. It is the fail race. I've got a Blinkmobile to try and overtake as well here. Who dare be... I mean, I've got really nothing to lose here. Like, absolutely nothing to lose here by going for it. Oh! Ah! <laughs> That is one way to do an aerial overtake. I say an aerial overtake. Oh, I think I might... Oh, I was going to say, I thought I might have lag punted him forward. I think he's just lagged forward himself. Now, who is going to be able to get the best line through all of this? Uh, no, not going to be me, I'm afraid. I tried to straighten it up, tried to get some grip. It's actually a good little battle for position there on those final couple of corners. Um, I just couldn't, yeah, get the power. <laughs> the aerial attack and spin was fantastic. I can't believe I managed to recover that and continue fighting for position all the way down the stairs. Like, you do some weird overtaking maneuvers. Like, there, there was genuine racing tactics in that one. There was cutbacks going on and everything while we were going downstairs in supercars. Like, that, <laughs> that's, that's, that is, to be fair, that is the fail race way. That is the fail race way of uh, doing the racing. I don't think anybody got lapped in all of that one. Uh, fastest lap time is all very, very close. Again going to be affected by catch-up cars running at the front for a long period of time. Oh, vehicle we're watching has had a bad day. Worse than my day. <laughs> there we go. Um, yeah. A lot of mayhem. Good fun. Good fun, though, this one. Uh, as ever, it is a Reese built track, so thank you very much to Reese for building it, and hopefully there shall be a link in the description so you can download it, have a go with it yourself. That'll be it from me, though. Thank you very much for watching, and until next time, uh, goodbye.